from World of Concrete 2018 from the Las Vegas Convention Center. With me now is Terry Kobayashi, who represents Max USA. How are you? I am great, Roger. Thank you. Well, it's you. great to have you with us. I am pleasured. You brought some toys. Yes, uh, we have a new tool that came out this concrete show. I love this name of this. It's a tire tire. <laughs> yeah, the twin tire, rb 441 t series. That's what it is. Okay. Right. But so. I tell you what, this is almost weightless. What, four or five pounds? Uh, yeah, 5.6 pounds. 5.6 pounds. It's nothing, okay? Old man like me can lift this thing and do the job, but it's, it's something else. It's amazing what this will do and, and, and Ter uh, Terry's going to kind of give us a little demo here. All right, so it's real easy. Um, it's a battery operated uh, rebar tying tool. So all you have to do is pu push on the switch and it's ready to go. So we have a grid here. I just want to show you guys real quick. Simple as that. It's about uh, approximately half seconds per shot. As you can see, the uh, wire also is bent down. It's very safe um, and very efficient, I would have to say. It's amazing. It's just really amazing. And it is so lightweight and so compact. How many ties could you get out of it? I know there's a cylinder in here with, with all the tie on it. How many could you get out of that? Um, right here we have a spool that uh, ties about 260 per uh, spool. And also the battery charge is about uh, 4,000 capacity. So it'll get you through a job site, no problem, usually. You know, depending on the job site. But, well, uh, sure, depending on the job, but 4,000? Oh yeah, 4,000. Wow, that yes. is something. Oh yeah, the lithium ion battery that we've been using for our other tools as well is also usable for this tool. And I guess it just consumes uh, less wire per Oops. shot, so that's what it makes the capacity right. come up, for right. example. And it's very simple, easy to thread, easy to load? Oh yeah, very easy. So what we have here is a magazine right here. And all you gotta do is open the latch and press down on this button here that releases the gears over here. And we have a spool that we locate inside in the wire right here. Yeah. The reason why it's called a twin tire is because it's got two wires that you have to put in at the, at the same time, you see? So you gotta put it into the gear, make sure it goes all the way through. We have a little window here. And then you close the magazine, pop the lever right here to close the gears. Right. And then you latch on the lever and you're ready to go. Almost like threading a sewing machine. Oh yeah, it's uh, <laughs> just as easy, sir. Yeah. That very easy, much. very easy. Yes. Well, it's an interesting piece of equipment, I'll tell you what. And you've been in this line before. This is not your new piece of equipment. Oh, no, we've been, exactly. We've been doing this for a very long time. So uh, Max is actually the uh, original um, inventors of the uh, battery-operated rebar tying tool. Uh, the first one that came out in the States was about, it was 1993, and I was only two years old. So <laughs> that kind of you know gives you perspective right, on right. how long we've been dealing with these tools. Well. This has got to be really something for the industry itself because number one, it's so lightweight. It's going to, uh, uh, an operator of this uh, on the construction site is going to be able to tie a lot of rebar. Oh yeah, oh, in yeah. a short period of time, which yes, of course speeds up the entire job. Oh yeah, it's that's why um, it is much much more efficient. I would say. I mean, I've uh, seen guys do you know hand tie before, snap tie, and uh, right. different types of rebar. Right. And you know, occasionally you have guys that are really confident and they say, you know, I could be a tool any day. And um, I bring this thing out, even our older generation models too. They've never <laughs> beaten a single tie. Well, I go back to the years where I remember guys certainly in some occasions tying ties with the old pliers. You remember oh, the old yeah, pliers? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That We're had the slots them. in those? Yes, sir. Yep. And that's, that's going back a number of years. Oh, yeah. But, I mean, it wasn't on a on a work site necessarily where you'd have a lot of ties to do, uh -huh. but it just seemed so uh, so really uh, elementary. <laughs> <laughs> I would say that too, maybe. You know yeah. I mean? If you have something like this, uh, I, I guarantee you, if someone's doing hand tie yep. and they try this thing out, yeah. they're not gonna go back. No, 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 no that's sure. for sure. Yeah. Well, I certainly appreciate you stopping by, bringing your message. This is one fine piece of equipment. Thank Terry you so much. Kobayashi, who's the uh, marketing manager with Max USA, and this is a really fine RB441T. Certainly stop by Max here at the show, or stop by one of your Max dealers and check this baby out. All this from World of Concrete 2018.